Yo, what's up guys, it's MRCV1 here, and uh, this is my Resident Evil 2 video on PC mods, basically running on the PS4, and um, I'll be showing how to do it in a different video, but this is just kind of showing off the mods, so um, in case you haven't already noticed, there's a new skin for the gun, so it's kind of like a, well, I guess it's more vibrant, kind of retro, like style and synth wave and stuff, I guess, but we got a lot more mods coming up that I'll talk about throughout the video. But I'll leave it as like a surprise until they show up, so yeah. Jesus. Open up! Hurry! Open up! Open this goddamn door! I'll get you out! Help me! Please! Give me your hand. Help me! I got you. Give me your other hand! Okay, and this is our second mod, so it's uh, zombies and they have snowman heads. Now there's more variants, they're not all snowman heads, but I'll speak about the other variants and they show up. So this first one is a uh, zombie with a snowman head, kind of like, gives it a Christmas vibe, I guess. But um, there's a lot more zombies in this, which um, you guys will see soon enough. And uh, they have different variants. Some zombies, I will say, don't have the heads it mainly seems to be like zombies that are used as props <laughs> Thanks. Marvin Brenner. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... I couldn't... Here. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. So this is what I um, meant by prop zombies, kind of, I know it's not like exactly a prop, but like, I don't really know what else to say it is. I mean, I guess it kind of is a prop at the same time. You see, because he's kind of already got his face modded and he's not like an actual zombie that wakes up. He just kind of shows up as um, normal pitch. I think it's fine. It, it doesn't really affect the game or anything, it's just the way it is. Ok, 
Okay, so this is the pumpkin head zombie. I think they look pretty cool. They give off a really nice Halloween vibe. But, um, they're not my favourite ones. But they are very scary, like, when you bump into them. So definitely one of the best ones. Okay, so, um, yeah, I, I'm just gonna look, kill him, obviously, here, but, um, the next zombie, like, one of my favourites, and, uh, well, basically, he's about to show up. And this is it. So, he, he gives, like, well, the zombies have, like, this rabbit head, but it's got no eyes, just, like, darkness, but it's got that creepy smile, and it, it works really well on this character for zombies, because they have, like, bloody hands and stuff. So they look absolutely terrifying and I mean this place is really good for showing off all the zombies because there's so many of them. And um, I mean, <laughs> just look at him for yourself, I mean he's very scary. <laughs> <laughs> So the zombies may be scary, but there is something way scarier than all of the zombies combined. And that is the new look for Mr. X. So here he is, and basically he's now got a dinosaur suit, and it is Jesus terrifying, Christ. right? It makes it funny to play through the game, but also terrifying, because not unlike I'm not joking when you see him in the shadows you will be scared and it just gives him a whole new look and um, it's just a great mod to use on PS4 so um yeah another thing if you guys want to use this mod for your own Resident Evil to PS4 I will maybe leave a link in the description to that mod for an update file that will include all these mods, actually not maybe include that, I will include it so uh, you guys will just, if you want to, install the mods the game will play just the same but <laughs> there will be some new stuff to look at and obviously here he is choking us it's just, he's a crazy character to have and uh, if you guys like the mods, feel free to download the, um, well, the mod update in the description if you want to do it for yourself, uh, you can watch a tutorial by Modded Warfare. And uh, his videos are great for really any PS4 modding stuff, so I'd recommend checking out. But anyway, if you want to install these mods, just go to the link in the description and click on the Google Drive link. Download the like one gigabyte update file, something around one gigabyte, and just put it on a USB or send it to your PS4 through FTP if you want whatever you do just make sure you install it after installing the game and then make sure you keep the CUSA bit in it and it should work then you can just um, like if it doesn't work then just make sure to remove everything that's not the CUSA bit and then just uh, maybe put RE2 mods update so you know what it is then just install it and it should automatically add to your game and then as soon as you load in you should be able to see the mods um, so yeah enjoy anyway that's uh, that's me out so see you guys in the next one and uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and please subscribe